Today, we're gonna take a closer look into my new Surgitel 6.5X Loops. Last year, I made a video reviewing my loops. We talked about how magnification played an important role in my decision, as well as some of the features that helped me serve my community every single day. Thousands of patients later, and I can honestly still say that those loops are holding up strong. Now, as I've been practicing dentistry, I've started to notice a bit of tension and pain along my neck. So I would do what most normal people would do, go to the gym, do stretch exercises. I started taking yoga classes, which are incredibly difficult, um, but nothing was really working. So I decided to search for a loop company that focused a little bit more on ergonomics. Surgitel first caught my attention as I was swiping through my Instagram feed, and I noticed that some of the dentists that inspire me use Surgitel to perform incredible uh, biomimetic dentistry every single day. And as I dove deeper into the company, I discovered its focus on true ergonomics. Uh, a couple of emails later, a meeting with the CEO of the company, and now I'm excited to share with you all my new loops. These are the Surgitel FLM 6.5 mag loops. The Oakley frames fit incredibly comfortably around my ears, especially after a long day of clinical procedures. The 6.5 mag lenses allow me to do dentistry with precision and the wireless light is so nice because it untethers you from your battery pack and you can move uh, really freely around your patients throughout the day. So while we have a lot to talk about, let's go over each feature step by step. These particular loops are front lens mounted or FLM for short. Now I opted for the 6.5 mag lenses to allow me to do more detail-oriented procedures and consultations. But you must know that these lenses are very, very powerful. And I would only recommend choosing this much mag if you've had experience with the 5.0 or 5.5 in a previous pair of loops that you've owned. If you're switching from 3X or lower, be prepared to train your eyes to get accustomed to this much magnification when you're working with your patients. To give you an idea of how zoomed in we're talking about, I set up a couple of shots focusing on my pair of eyeglasses. The first clip represents what we see with our eyes. And the next gives you an idea of what we see at 6.5x. Yeah, it's pretty detail oriented. Now since these loops are front lens mounted, you do have the option to interchange the lens as you see fit. This freedom is actually quite nice if you want to change lenses depending on the type of procedure you're doing. For example, you may want to see if there's any cracks in a tooth with a loop that has more magnification and you may want to do your normal day-to-day -day restorative dentistry with something that isn't as powerful as this one. Now what makes these loops stand out in the ergonomic space is the very comfortable lightweight frames as well as the steep declination angle. Declination angle represents how steep the oculars on your loops point down. A steep declination angle is important to prevent unnecessary head tilting, which can cause musculoskeletal pain, uh, like the neck pain that I was having um, earlier this year. The front lens mounted loops allowed Surgitel to provide a very steep declination angle, uh, but the company does also offer TTL or through the lens loops um, at a great declination angle as well. Another feature to consider when purchasing dental loops involves nasal bridge support. Every person has a unique facial structure which can influence how loops fit on your face. Different nose attachments helps offer support to the those that have a high or low nasal bridge. This nose pad is the most comfortable for my type of nose as I work throughout the day. 
Finally, I wanna talk a little bit about wireless LED lights, which I've been interested in for quite some time now. This light system has been incredibly fun to work with. Being untethered has allowed me to move completely free around my patient. Uh, I don't get snagged uh, with my wire on a chair or knocking instruments around, and it just feels more comfortable. On the other hand, wireless lights do have a limited battery time. So you're gonna have to get used to changing it multiple times throughout the day. You have to consider whether this is gonna bother you or not. It hasn't affected me much, um, but when I do have procedures that last a little bit over an hour, I have had to get up out of my chair, change the light and come back. Is that a bad thing? Not necessarily, typically I just give the patient a minute or two break to rest their jaw before moving on to the next part of the procedure. But for those of you that are doing a lot of these long-winded or technical procedures, you may want to stick to the standard light that has a battery pack and a cable. To date, I have loved these loops. They're incredibly comfortable and lightweight. I love all the features that we mentioned earlier in the video. My neck has been feeling more comfortable, a lot less neck pain than I had before. And I think that's due to a combination of the loop design, as well as the stretching, the yoga, and me focusing on proper ergonomics as I work and uh, perform clinical dentistry every single day. I want to sincerely thank Surgitel for providing me these loops uh, to review on my channel. I think it's a great product and I'm excited to see what other new technology comes out of the company in the future. So I hope this video gives you all some insight to a different loop company on the market. You know, there are a bunch of amazing uh, loop companies out there and I think you need to do your due diligence researching each and every one of them to see what works best for you. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm more than willing to answer any comments down below. I've been bad at that before in the past, but I'm trying to get better at responding to you guys more quickly. Uh, thank you so much for the support on the channel. Please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you for the next one. Thank you.